go on then, introduce yourselves from my right to my left. Hello, I'm Dolan. I'm the vocalist and harmonica player Mad Daddy. Hello, I'm Twist. I play drums in Mad Daddy. I'm Liam. I play guitar in Mad Daddy. <laughs> And no, <laughs> and no one's going to pretend to be the missing fourth member then. No. <laughs> <laughs> Who are we missing, darling? Uh, Elvis Paluca, bass player. Oh, <laughs> we're missing, we're missing Elvis. Elvis, we do miss you. You know, next time, come up and see us. But it's great to have you guys with us. And it's been an exciting Thanks, time, a really exciting time. So first of all, full album out now. Yep. I mean, it has been a little while coming, Dolan, hasn't it? <laughs> yeah, you could say so. Um, well, been doing recording for probably four or five years now, longer. But um, no, I've got focused on doing a full album in the last two years or so, and uh, finally done it last year on vinyl as well, which is a green bonus. vinyl. Yeah. How exciting! And how how has the vinyl been received then? Because I keep trying to tell everyone here, get vinyl. Vinyl's great. Everyone loves vinyl. It is still super popular, isn't it? Has it been going well? Yeah, it's probably our strongest selling platform and everyone who's picked one up says it sounds great and looks good and it's yeah, it's nice to have like a physical item really. Like digital's nice and all, but vinyl's a, it's a permanent thing, isn't it? Well, because you are, you do have a really sort of fresh and new sound, but also you do reference quite a lot of bands from uh, sort of yesteryear as such. So to have that traditional format must be really nice. Yeah, definitely. It's uh feels like a more genuine recording artist now, uh, <laughs> like the old guys. Like the old guys. Uh, oh, I love it. Well, come to how exciting it's been for you over the past year or so. But uh, Twist, tell me about the recording process then. What was, what was it like? Where did you go? What did you do? How did it uh, go? Well, we were recording at Battle Groove Studios. That was good. I remember the uh, first time we did the recording, I think I'd been in the band for about a day. <laughs> I think Dolan just messaged me. He was like, oh, yeah, well, we're there. He was looking for a new drummer, and I was like, oh, I'll give it a go. You know, not really played much of that stuff myself before. And he was like, all right, yeah, I'll give it a go. He's like, all right, we're recording tomorrow. Do you want to come down? And I was like, what? <laughs> <laughs> so it was really uh, just off the bat, giving it a go. But that was really good. Second time was a lot more organised, because we actually knew the songs before we were recording them. We weren't writing them as we were playing them. Yeah. And yeah. Yeah, so like two, the first two tracks on the album are from a different recording session. So that's the one Matt was talking about. Yeah. And then the rest we did in the second session. And it's quite, um, Lee, we'll come to you now, Liam, because it is, it's a, a really sort of incendiary sound and loads yeah, yeah. of energy in there. Really raw, really kind of slightly kind of dirty sounding. How do you translate that from live to recorded then? Basically just set up how we would set up live. I mean, the, the guitar was loud in the studio. Like, you know, your brain was kind of bouncing a little bit after a few hours of that. Um, but yeah, just set up like a live environment and record it basically live and overdub a few guitars after that but yeah well i think what we should do is play uh what i think is your lead single i think would you say ride with me is your lead single from this yeah yeah well that's the one we did the video for and that's yeah. had the most radio play and stuff so which is and it's getting that's some the hit. Yeah. it's the hit it that's, is. that's the one iggy pop played oh just <laughs> drop that name in there i think we should try and name drop him multiple, multiple times, times. Who, iggy pop yeah, iggy. yeah that's a good idea. who did yeah, you say sorry who? To mention iggy uh, pop a few times yeah, yeah. 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 iggy pop. iggy pop he played us on the radio yeah iggy pop played you on the radio i heard that i heard a little birdie said that maybe iggy pop played you on the radio well iggy pop might have played this song which is called ride with me this is the excellent mad daddy 